Hi there, welcome to my session and I'm going to handle the trench warfare as a cause of World War One. So uh, we first saw the Western Front the other time. So we have what we call the trench warfare. Uh, so after pulling back, the Germans started digging the trenches which were being reinforced by the barbed wire and the French and the British also did likewise and these trench warfare meant that little advance could be made by either sides and these trenches extended from belgian coast to the alps again new weapons were being introduced in a bid to circumvent the stalemate occasioned by trenches as well raged on and these weapons included the use of poison gas by the german in the year 1915 also aeroplanes which were only used for reconnaissance initially or from 1915 used to bomb enemy camps. The Germans were the first to introduce Zeppelin airships, which were being named after their inventor Ferdinand von Zeppelin. However, iron bombing had little effect on the war. And also, in the year 1916, the British began using tanks. In the year 1915, the Allies would, or they persuaded the Italians to their side, and they promised them two Austrian districts of Trieste and Treretri. And after, after the war, this was crucial as it held Austrian forces in the Alps and stopped them from attacking Russia in the east. And in the year 1916, among the most intense times when the horrific battle took place at Verdun and Somme, and in the first half of 1916, the French held German advance at Verdun, while the combined force of French kept the Germans at bay at Somme River, and the British lost 19,000 soldiers, while 36,000 soldiers were being injured by the Germans. The British lost 500,000 each at Somme River battle, and this battle costed the Germans and the allies a third million men each so after the trench warfare there was what you call the expansion of military alliances alliances and by the end of 1915 so many countries had either joined the triple alliance or the triple entente and those who tr supported triple entente included japan and they entered these war with the hope of capturing german territories in the far east whereas italy she was being promised share of spoils by the triple entente it also included belgium serbia and montenegro so uh, the triple alliance attracted turkey and bulgaria triple alliance and triple entente they became meaningless as more powers than the original three on both sides were now involved on the war and as a result triple entente changed its name from central powers while the triple entente became the allied powers or simply the allies so that's all about the trench in warfare uh the uh the trench warfare and also expansion of military alliances